live. Welcome to the Vortex Healing Centre and we're doing a special meditation tonight for the solstice. Yes, welcome. So I hope you've all been enjoying your solstice, the beautiful change when the days go from shorter to longer. That will be so nice. Okay. Okay, so with the um, solstice energies this year, they have been really, really rugged and very, very powerful. We've had a, a huge amount of energy coming in and I'm sure all of you have as well. But um, with no sleep at all the night before last, it was just was starting to wear a bit thin. But however, everything's fine after a good night's sleep last night. And we'll get you all now to grab your favourite crystal and make yourself nice and comfortable. We'll start as always by doing our three deep breaths from the centre of the earth, drawing deeply from our dear Mother Gaia, bringing it up through our feet. Bring it up through our feet, right up into our higher heart. Three deep breaths from the centre of the earth. Now we'll take three deep breaths from the centre of the universe, drawing down from the great central sun. From the galactic centre. Totally filling the top of your chest as far as it goes and then a little bit more. Expanding your higher heart. Allowing your higher self to bring more and more energy, knowledge, awareness. We do three combined breaths from the center of the earth, the center of the universe. So there's a bit of background noise, we're just shuffling through things a bit. As we're doing our combined breathing, we're getting the energy of the mother and the father flowing through our higher heart and merging now with our own, very own seed of life.
we have formed our own very own trinity with father mother and ourselves and we've also invited our higher self closer and closer as close as it can come which means we can get more information more direction and perhaps a few memories will come back with their higher self coming closer because it does hold all the knowledge of us all we've ever been and all we will become as well but today the equinox or nothing the, the solstice is bringing back the knowledge it's symbolic of to us in the southern hemisphere it's symbolic of the days starting to get longer and the light returning. We're coming out of our winter hibernation slowly and gradually but we are starting to see more of the, of the light. The big new energies that have come in, I believe, have to do with the Divine Feminine. The balancing out a, an aspect of the Divine Male that hasn't been flowing freely. But it's also really ramping up the grids. Now, anybody who is an Earth worker will know that the grids are, are firing up really big. There's lots of little energies that you see with the naked eye now and darting backwards and forwards and vibrations and little rifts in the ether and all kinds of stuff really. it's starting to really um, bring us into the new earth or what the new earth will appear to be You will notice a big difference with the animals in particular. The birds, they appear to be talking to us now, they come closer, they look at us. You can feel little bits of energy if you're lucky. And of course the animals, the domestic animals are, are getting closer and closer to actually physical talking. And they're getting closer and closer to be able to understand their talk. They are responding a lot more to us, to our emotions, to our feelings, to what we want them to do. They're anticipating them. They've stepped up to a new, a new level. going forwards now from the solstice I believe we've entered a new timeline and it's pretty much adjusting now right through the another guy and it's affecting all the grids it's affecting all living things communication now is a whole different ball game now. We're not thinking or trying to send thoughts to people or trying to pick up thoughts from people. We're actually doing it through awareness and we're doing that by turning our minds off and actually listening. 
And as we listen, we will draw that energy to us. And then our mind will interpret it. It is now a whole different program and we are learning to interpret energy rather than to pick up thoughts. The law of attraction is just a, a wonderful thing because you think of something and then you stop and listen. And you've immediately started the process of drawing the answer, the solution, or whatever it is you want from that energy to you. And if you practice this now, you'll find that it starts to really flow. And the more time you spend listening and being aware, the less time our brain is functioning. It goes into a, into a, a, a quiet mode. It cannot think and listen at the same time. It has to listen and think. So the more we listen, the greater our awareness is going to grow. So the more we can actually listen to ourselves, to what we draw to us, to what other people send to us, the quicker we're going to get a handle on this new timeline and the 5D energies. So in your quiet time tonight, I want you to listen. And if it helps you, you can breathe in and out of your solar plexus which will still stimulate your awareness. You can try creating a thought and then see if the answer just arrives. Just listen to the answer. This is all going forwards. It's what we need to do go forwards in the new realm we're creating. So I'll leave you for a bit and talk very shortly.
in there becomes a very, very important realization. We have a whole new timeline. It's pure, it's pristine. All we have to do to keep it in that condition is to send love, gratitude, compassion, happiness, everything positive. Let's blast our grids with pure, positive, joyful. If you find yourself thinking negative thoughts, stop it immediately and change it into a positive thing. We have to keep our goods pristine in order to keep going forwards and lessening the, the releasing the garbage we have to go through. And cleanse, clear, and make positive our own good lines in our body. And we send it into the grids above and below the earth. This is a great offering in the progress of mankind. Keep our time in mind for I know you can all do it, so... As you bring yourself back from this meditation now, make a firm commitment to yourself catch any negative thoughts and change it to a positive, to send love and happiness and compassion and gratitude, all the positive feelings into the goods, keep flooding them with positive and happy and love. And we'll have this new world up and running really quickly. Have to now keep breathing deeply until you're ready to come back totally. Nice deep combined breaths. Right from the centre of the earth, the centre of the universe. And keep breathing deeply until you're fully back and fully grounded. Well, this is Sue from the Vortex Series here, but thank you for joining us in this meditation tonight. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. Thanks again for joining us. <laughs>